Sound familiar? You need to collaborate, share, and store documents securely. But you can't risk your sensitive data being scanned, analyzed, or accessed by big tech companies. That's where Proton's secure workspace comes in. With Proton Docs, you get collaborative document editing with end-to-end -end encryption, so you can work together and securely share and store the docs you create without compromising privacy. I like my privacy. Before we dive into this tutorial, make sure to subscribe to our channel and hit that notification bell. Today, I'm going to show you everything you need to know to use Proton Docs effectively, from creating your first documents to collaborating securely with your team. Here's what most people don't realize about document collaboration. Every time you use Google Docs or Office 365, you're essentially giving those companies access to read everything you write. Proton Docs uses zero access encryption, which means your documents are encrypted before they even leave your device. Proton can't read them, governments can't subpoena them, hackers can't access them, and big tech can't scan the data for training AI. It's off limits. But here's the thing, it works like any other office suite. You get real-time collaboration, commenting, suggestion modes, and all the features you expect. The only difference is, it's actually private. Let's start with the basics. Proton Docs is accessed through Proton Drive, so you'll need to know how to navigate this interface. First, log into your Proton Drive account. You can access this at drive.proton.me. From here, you can create new documents or manage your existing files. Notice the clean, organized layout. Everything is designed for productivity and security. Let's create a document. The process is pretty straightforward, but there's a few things you should know. To create a new document, click the New button in the top left corner. Then select New Document from the drop-down menu. Perfect! You now have a blank document. Notice it opens with a default name. To rename it, simply click on the document name in the top left corner and select Rename Document from the drop-down. Let's call this Q4 Strategy Document and hit Enter. Now let's explore the editing features. Proton Docs has everything you need for professional document creation. The toolbar at the top contains all your formatting options. Let's go through the most important ones. I'll type some content so we can see the formatting in action. Basic text formatting works exactly as you'd expect. Bold, italic, and underline. You can also change text color and add highlighting. You can create numbered lists, bullet points, or even checklists. These are perfect for organizing information. Adding links is simple. Select your text, click the link icon, and paste your URL. You can also insert images directly from your device. Just click the image icon and upload your file. Position your cursor where you want the table and click Insert Table in the toolbar. By default, you get a table with a highlighted header row. To add more rows or columns, hover over the edge of the table until you see a plus sign appear. Click it to add a new row or column. For more advanced options, hover over any cell and click the grid icon. This gives you options to duplicate rows, delete columns, clear contents, and more. You probably have existing documents you want to work with. Proton Drive makes this easy. From your main Proton Drive interface, you can drag and drop existing files directly into your drive. I'll drag a Word document into Proton Drive. To edit the Word document in Proton Docs, right click on it and select Open in Docs. Here's something important when you edit an existing file in Proton Docs, it creates a copy in Proton format. Your original file stays untouched. Now for the really powerful stuff, secure collaboration. To share a document, click the share button in the top right corner. You'll see a sharing dialog. Enter the email addresses of the people you want to collaborate with. You can give them either viewer or editor permissions. You can also add a personal message to explain what you're sharing and why. Click share to send the invitations. Your collaborators will receive an email with a secure link to access the file. Here's the key difference from other platforms. That link is encrypted, and only people with Proton accounts can access it. No one else can see your files, not even Proton. Let's see collaboration in action. I've invited my colleague to edit the document. 
So let's follow the complete process. After I sent the invitation, my colleague received a secure email with a link to access the document. When my colleague clicks the link, they're taken to a secure page where they need to log into their Proton account to access the document. Now, when my colleague opens the document, I can see their presence indicator in the top right. It shows their initial, and if you click the initial, it jumps to their cursor's current position. For more formal collaboration, I can switch to suggesting mode by clicking the pencil icon. Now when I make changes, they appear as suggestions instead of direct edits. I can also add comments by selecting content and clicking the comment icon. Sometimes you need to change who has access to your files. Go to Shared and find your shared file. Click the three dots menu next to it. Select Manage Share to see all your collaborators. To change someone's permissions, click on their current role and select a new role. To remove someone's access entirely, select Remove Access. They'll immediately lose access to the file. Sometimes you need to share links with people who don't have Proton accounts. Public Links makes this possible. In the Share dialog, you'll see a Create Public Link section. Toggle this on to enable public sharing. A public link is generated that anyone can access. Copy this link and share it with your intended recipients. For added security, you can set an expiration date for the link or add password protection. And you can also stop sharing or remove the link whenever you need. Public links are perfect for sharing non-sensitive files with clients, partners, or even a wider audience. But remember, even public links maintain end-to-end -end encryption. Proton Docs automatically saves version history so you can review or restore earlier versions. Click on the file name and select See Version History to see all previous versions. Browse through previous versions and choose to either make a copy to create a new file from that version or restore this version to replace the current one. This is incredibly valuable for sensitive documents where you may need to track changes or recover from mistakes. Finally, let's cover how to export your files when you need to share them outside of Proton. Click on the document name. You can export documents in multiple formats, Word, PDF, HTML, Markdown, or plain text. This means you can work entirely in Proton, but still share files with people working in other platforms when necessary. Proton Docs isn't just another word processor. It's built for privacy-first collaboration. Proton ensures compliance with key regulations like HIPAA, GDPR, and CPPA, and Switzerland's robust privacy framework provides an additional layer of legal protection for your content. Even Proton staff cannot read your documents. This level of security is essential for legal professionals, investigative journalists, medical practitioners, and anyone managing confidential information. Your confidential documents shouldn't be mined for data by surveillance capitalism. Head over to drive.proton.me now and create your first secure document. Bring a teammate into a collaborative project and see for yourself how seamless and protected real-time editing can be. With Proton Docs, you can maintain efficiency while preserving privacy. If this walkthrough clarified Proton Docs for you, please like this video and subscribe to our channel and activate notifications for more Proton content. Have questions about Proton Docs? Share them in the comments section. We review every comment and frequently we develop follow-up content based on your suggestions. Begin using Proton Docs today. Your confidential information will thank you.